Alright, this is Launch Base Zone, Robotnik's new, uh. new base, where he's building another one of his big ship. Alright, Tails, he doesn't know we're here yet, so just follow my moves. Sneak around. Be careful not to make a sound. Don't, don't touch that! Now he's gonna send a bird? What? Well, I was expecting him to bring out, like, a thousand swap bots or something, because there's an intruder, probably Sonic here. But no, let's just send a bird after him, why not? Maybe the rest was on lunch. Also, this is fun. What? <laughs> because sprite drawing. You broke. What's the matter, you never see a hedgehog defying gravity before? Nope. Or physics? <laughs> so, yeah. If you have a look at the background back there, you can see that Robotnik is actually rebuilding the Death Egg, the machine they used in Sonic 2 to try and take over the world. He's rebuilding it, and he's gonna try and relaunch it, but we're not gonna let that happen. Nope. Come on, Tails, it's time to go for an elevator ride. That'll be fun, right? Sure. He can hardly wait. Oh god, you alright? Ugh. Why? Why does he keep building these things? He has one in like all of his bases. Ow. <laughs> a little, still feeling a little dizzy yeah, after little that dizzy. elevator ride. Well, he's always got spinning things all over his base that he uses to get around. Is is this really how he's getting around? The guy sure does have a lot of G-force resistance. He should be an astronaut or something. <laughs> But yeah, as far as Ow. as far as last zones go, and indeed this is the last zone if you are playing Sonic 3 Vanilla, this zone isn't too bad. I rather like the music. Another hmm. Michael Jackson, I'm guessing. Ow. Sure sounds like it. Oh, also electric shield over here in case you're not uh, in case you jump straight into this. Come on, Tails, you can make it up here. Uh. You can just fit through. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. I'm back down again. Oh well. I guess he just wanted to go for a ride in the teacups. <laughs> I like the teacups. Yeah, so do I. I want to go for a ride too. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I don't like teacups anymore! Oh. Oh. <laughs> I think that one's broken. Oh boy. I don't, I'm not trusting the spinning things anymore. How about we go higher? It's probably safer up there. Not going up. Is there okay? Yeah, right here should be fine. Also, these enemies are kind of weird. They only move when you move. I don't like them. <laughs> Very interesting. Alley -oop. Oh. Ooh, that was slick. <laughs> <laughs> he jumped in between them, then. I make it look scary. <laughs> Whee! I love these things. Uh? Whoosh! Whee! Oh, right, saving the world. Staying focused, staying on task. Okay, so we got a platform here. Another one of these guys. Ow. Good thing we got a shield down here that we can take. But, what was the point of that room? We go in here, flip a couple of switches, and then go right back out. Eh, whatever. There's nothing in there apart from death. Well, this looks like a weird elevator. Tails, you want to investigate this? Sure. What Look. the... Tails, I think you're breaking physics again. Okay, wait, so I can fix this. What? I... Oh! Where, where'd he go? What? I, th I think the floor just ate him. Sonic. Whoa, coming back for more, I see. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. I'm getting the heck out of here. Now what? moon running out of here. <laughs> moon running never ceases to amuse. No. Nope. And neither does this. If I can pull it off. <laughs> awesome. Uh, oh god, no. <laughs> this is this is just funny to look at. It's very noisy. A little bit, I suppose. So, yeah, I've already said what I think of Launch Base. What do you think of it? Uh, it's, it's alright. It doesn't feel like a last zone. Um, 
Yeah, actually, now that you mention it, no, it doesn't. I mean, compare this to Scrap Brain or Metropolis, even though Metropolis isn't technically a last zone. Troll Spring. It, it's, it doesn't have the difficulty. It doesn't have any of those slicer equivalents in it. No. None of the, uh, like, electric barriers that are constantly knocking you off your feet. Still, it does have its charm, I suppose. Also, one other point I wanted to make. I'm invincible. What? You know, powered by awesome! <laughs> but enough of that, time for a bonus. Let's see if I can get some sort of goodies out of here. And this is Come on, reach the thing! Okay. It's so hard for player two, because you just feel like you're getting in the way. Yeah, I, I can kind of see what you mean, because they use up all of, like, the side springs there. Yeah, I'm just trying to, like, stay in the middle, but then I collect everything. Oh, what up? Oh, I got away. A dumb fire shield that you don't really need. Well, I mean, we do have a lot of fire-based traps that could be useful against, but, eh. You were there, you tried, I would rather have you than a computer, personally. <laughs> Oh, you see, I kind of slid up that hill. <laughs> like but, really yeah. Now. Another thing I wanted to make note of about this zone that uh, kind of surprises me, really, is that unlike places like Scrap Brain or... Are you flying through that thing? What? what? I can't break it. Tails, please. There you go. Oh! Ow. Sorry, Tails. Just... Not sorry. <laughs> Such a bully, Sonic. Also, fire. This is fun. <laughs> uh, right, what was I talking about? Yeah that uh, this zone is a little different from Scrap Brain or Chemical Plant in that, well, if you look around, there's no pollution happening anywhere. Is no it... no polluted water, no chemicals, no none of that. There's a lot of green, actually. There's a lot of... That's it. He's promoting green energy. He's not the bad guy at all. Maybe we were wrong to be going after him. He's not giving all the nature. That's right. We've got Robotnik- OH GOD DANG IT THIS- Oh no, 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 he needs to die. I will rip through every piece of security that he has. He's gonna pay for this! Urgh. Make me lose my ring. Oh yeah, watch out for those spike crushers. They will kill you in one hit. Oh god! I already lost all my lunch, I can't lose anymore. Coming, Tails! Yeah. On my way. Ooh, that was impressive. What? <laughs> Bye, Tails. Bye, oh, jeez! Would you like me to fly what back up? What kind of spike placement is this? Let me fly back up. It's alright. I think I can make do from here. Okay. Thankfully, we're getting pretty close now, and uh, just in time, because we're running out of it. Once again, long zones. Robotnik! That's Looks that. like he was in the middle of building another one of his little towers here, but uh, we kind of interrupted his work. Ah. Oh, you would like me to ride all these teacups to the top, wouldn't you? So that I could go into a trap or something. But we're gonna be smarter than that, aren't we, Tails? Yep. All right, let's go see what he's up to. The comfy robot. Chuckles used Leer. Oh God, I'm frozen in place. What? <laughs> what? Chuckles? Ah! How'd, you, how'd you do? No! Tails, come out! No, Tails! Oh, oh God! Oh! Oh god! Tails! Tails is dead! Sonic. No! I will avenge you, buddy! How'd you do that? Um, I flew back. Hmm. You'll have to show me that trick later. <laughs> For now, let's stop Robotnik! Get back here! Dang it, he got away! And he left another robot for Ow. us! How considerate of him. Tell you what, Tails, why don't you handle this guy while I stay off to the side and continue to lose rage? <laughs> okay. I mean, this is my first boss. I don't know how well I'm gonna do. I believe in you. Well, you've knocked out one of them. Yeah, this is one of those bosses that actually gets easier as you go forward. <laughs> when it is getting more damage, so it makes sense. Ugh. You did okay. it! Good job, buddy! I killed the thing. Even though you beat the boss, though, I think I'll still take credit for it. What? <laughs> Only Sonic. Oh, one day my name will be there. Maybe. One day. Alright, on we go to Act 2. Now we've got some sky blue skies, as a change from the aqua blue that we had in the previous act. 
And also, there's a lot more clouds around. Little details, they're noticeable. And uh, the foreground that we had in the last act is now the background, and the background we had in the last act is now the foreground. See, we've got all those red towers that we saw before, which means the death egg will be just up ahead. Kind of like how the level wraps ow, around like Ow, that. ow, ow. There, that was a little better for you, Tails. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a pretty cool game design right there. Yeah, we've got a lot we need to do in this second act, so advanced apologies, Tails, if I'm not waiting as long as I should be for you to catch up with me. Well, where is he? Oh, right. there you are. Ah! Oh, well. Guess you didn't want to be here. <laughs> I must have down the I don't feel like taking that hook. I'm going to take the lower <laughs> one. And by lower, I mean upper. One side. Oh. Woo! Come on, Tails. Catch on. He's such a big meanie. <laughs> <laughs> That's amusing for some reason. This place doesn't look very safe. Well, I mean, the whole place isn't really safe. I mean, the floor will probably give way at any moment now. Yeah. Really, the only thing you can trust around here are the stars in the sky. They give you things like fire shields. I would like a fire shield right now. Oh, yeah, we got rep. Ooh, 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 uh, uh, ooh. Got it. And the one up. From all the rings that we just gathered. Indeed, that run couldn't have gone any better. Truly, you are my best friend ever. Uh, I love you too, Sonic. We touched on it a little bit in the last act, but the uh, overall difficulty of launch base compared to some other final acts in the series, such as Scrap Brain or Metropolis. I know Metropolis wasn't technically a last level, but it was penultimate. But yeah, the overall difficulty is not so bad. And also, yeah, don't spin dash up this hill, otherwise you'll hit these Robotnik monitors, and that's not good. And no, your friend won't hit them either. So, uh -oh. don't worry about that. Stylish. <laughs> More stylish! We walk. Michael Jackson would be proud. <laughs> Until I got to this point. And yeah, water and fire still don't mix. Neither does electricity, so, uh... Get yourself a bubble shield, we'll help you out there. Also, if you use Tails at this point, he can fly you up over these pipes, and then you can, uh, jump off and go in this direction. That'll cut the stage by about one-third. But, I don't want to cut the stage, I want to show off everything we got to go here. So we're gonna jump into these, uh, chemical plant-like tubes, where we just shoot through. Yeah, Robotnik is apparently siphoning out all the water, and that's not cool. Anyway, yeah, I gotta go ahead and hit this ring box here. Wait, what?! You very clearly saw Ow. me jumping at this ring box here, and for some reason it hits the Robotnik monitor instead. What is hit detection? <laughs> Alright, this next bit here is going to be kind of tricky, but if I pull it off, it's going to be filled with awesome! You don't want to get too close to this laser here, otherwise you might find yourself getting zapped by it. Although I don't know, I feel like I'm getting pretty Ow. close to it right now. I mean, look at this, it's going right through my head! I guess it just doesn't work on hedgehogs? Oh, well. Definitely I'm okay with this, really. Head on over here for a hidden one-off. Very nice. And let's continue onward. Oh! Oh, you know what? You're gonna pay for that, buddy. Stylish. <laughs> oh, fire. Ah, it's way down there. I'm not too worried about that. Oh. You should watch out for those fox lasers, Tails. Yeah. I don't even know why I bothered dodging that. We already know it doesn't work on me. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Woo, 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 woo. Got time for some more moon running? Yes, I should say we do. Oh. Oh, hmm. Actually, Tails, gotta get a little bit of a lift up here. Going up. Normally you can get up here if you do a good enough spin dash, but I didn't. Very good. Excuse me. And we've got some more teacups over here. Oh no, this one's gonna break. I am bailing out. Whew, that was close. Waiting on you, Tails. Okay. Now, let's head on down. Boop, 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 boop. That was kinda cool. 
But now it's time to make our way into the drink at last. Yes, of course. Water sections. No shortage of them in Sonic 3. Let's go for a teacup ride. Woo, woo, woo. My stop. What? What? <laughs> no. Because there's fun stuff over here. Such as uh, rings and invincibles. Oh, time for a classic. Ah, uh, no. No, Sonic, such a bully. I am such a good friend. Such a bully. And I'm just gonna take and my time and make sure every single robot along the way is destroyed because, you know, I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, that's my job. Did I get them all? Yeah, it looks like it. Sonic. Better hell now. Ah! Uh, why? Ah, uh, the classic labyrinth. <laughs> <laughs> why would you do that? Because I love giving you a heart attack. Uh. Once again, best friend ever. <laughs> Good old bubble shield here. Probably could have used this earlier, I don't know. Yeah. Maybe I could have used it. I've noticed on this water there's no bubbles. Yeah, no air bubbles under the water this time, so That's... your only source of air is a bubble shield. But the water's not that deep, so I don't think it's too much of an issue. Still, don't spend too long in there. Whoa! Alright, let's get going. Give yourself a good roll so that you have enough momentum to get up to this ring box. Oh, well, oh well. We don't need him. We got 76 rings. We're good. And it's time for the boss. He's got a new machine for us, and... Tails, what are you doing up there? Okay. Uh, I better up. get up there. Whoa! Suck through the wall. <laughs> but Tails has a good advantage po vantage point here, so... Good for him. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, that was good teamwork. I was distracting him while you were uh, tinkering with his machine from below. Good job! Now let's see if you can get this egg pod working. Okay. Wait, Ow. Tails! How did you miss that? We're on a 2D plate. You know what? Forget it. I'll just finish the level myself. In fact, I'll finish the game myself. In fact, Tink has his name out of the corner. I'm just gonna finish this. This is now the red show. Uh oh. Haha! Oh, my plan to knock you back by two feet was a success! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh no. One other thing I really feel I should draw attention to. This cutscene is unskippable and the timer is still running. We have to go through an entire stage, a three-phase boss fight, and this unskippable cutscene that goes on for almost a minute, all within a ten-minute time frame. That's part of the game design that I don't like about this. That ten-minute time limit just bugs the heck out of me in this game. They do fix the time in Sonic 3 and Knuckles so it doesn't run during this cutscene, but still, it's a problem I wish wasn't there in the first place. Anyway, we got ourselves another boss here. It's not going to be much harder to beat than the last one. Basically, just attack the dome. Be mindful of that little spike ball floating around. It might catch you a couple of times if you're not paying attention. But overall, he goes down in no time at all. Nice one. Well, that was nothing. Hey, where do you think you're going? And also, suddenly night sky. Who put out the lights? Behold the true final boss, Big Arm. You only get this boss fight if you're playing in Sonic 3 Vanilla. So, if you're playing this as Sonic 3 and Knuckles, that last boss we fought would be the last one that you face. Anyway, this one can be a little tricky because you don't have a lot of good opportunities to get your attacks in. Your thoughts on this? I think it's like a, a good boss. At the end of the day. Yeah, presumably they took this out at, um, of the uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles version. I guess this was just a bit too much to throw at the player right before Mushroom Hill. Still, though, it is a good final boss, albeit not quite as hard as, say, the Death Egg Robot or even the Final Zone boss. Those were both pretty tough, but uh, this guy, not so bad. Anyway, we finally bring him down. The ship starts falling apart. Oh, God. Or maybe just the platform that we're standing on. <laughs> the falling. Oh. He doesn't look too worried. Yeah. And then all of a sudden the sky starts lightning again. And down goes the death egg. What's it now again? Also look at the time. That was yeah, very close. close. Anyway, it goes into the back, and kaboom, just disappears. Yeah, that's what you get. And now Sonic celebrates in the most appropriate way possible, by punching me in the face! 
Thanks, buddy. Yay. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye.